Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. I was not getting time to publish new video tutorial because of my personal schedules. In previous tutorials we have seen how to set up Docker, run Jenkins in Docker and how to set up Docker Compose. The reason why we have set up Docker Compose was to create our own customized Docker image for Jenkins. If you have not subscribed to my channel please do so and like the videos. In today's tutorial we are going to configure docker compose yaml file and docker file to run Jenkins. You can check your docker installed version using docker version command and docker compose using docker compose hyphen v. Also let me show you the currently available images using docker images and the containers available using docker container ls hyphen a going to use the folder Jenkins images under home to store the docker compose yaml file and docker file. It is to be noted that both file need to be in same folder. Also we will be using slash var slash Jenkins as home directory for Jenkins. Let's create our docker compose yaml file. Using avi editor create the file, you can use the file extension as .yml or .yaml. To know more about yaml file configurations you can check out the docker tutorials. Follow along. The complete command are given in the video description. So you can copy it from there. Now let's create a docker file in the same location. Please keep in mind that the name of docker file starts with capital D. Great. We have both docker compose and docker file ready. Now it's time to build the image. Use the command docker compose build and wait for the image to be ready.
image is built and you can see that in the image is listed. And the next step is to run docker compose up to have the container running. You can also run the docker container in the normal way using the newly built image using docker run command.
great. We have created Docker image using Docker Compose and Docker file. We can do lot more however this is initial tutorial. We will see more about Docker Compose and other configurations in upcoming tutorials. Thank you for watching, kindly like the video and subscribe to my channel.